ahead and, and look. He's a holy man. His name might be Pardu. <laughs> This is an I'm um, able, yeah, able to go up and check like a heal check or uh, perception. Uh, do a, well, what are you trying to see exactly? I'm trying to find out if this is an actual body. Cause okay, yeah, do a I'm, heal check. I'm wondering, 20? Uh, this is not only an actual body, this is a freshly deceased corpse. Uh, uh, you're, you're both disgusted and yet impressed by the ability for uh, the murderer to drain the body of its blood. But oh, this is God. definitely freshly I'm, deceased. Am I able to identify what race the person was before this happened? Uh, it appears to be either elven or human. I guess it's a silly question to ask, but can I identify what the cause of death was? <laughs> <laughs> well, being there's, a, there's a serious lack of a the head. Blood right. well, might have been I know the head's gone, but he, she could have died of something before that. <laughs> yes, no. I will. You don't, you don't see any uh, puncture wounds or, or any sort of other wounds on the body, or even bruises on the body, which is odd. Um, but you suspect that decapitation was probably the cause. I'm, I'm okay. going to uh, suggest that he search for any sort of items that might help identify the body. Yeah. <clears throat> like, uh, the body's dressed in a nightgown, um, but that's it. I'm okay. guessing this is then isn't it... actually his wife, it's more just a... Yeah, it's just a Him reminder. Like... Reminder. Um, uh... I, I say to Khan, is there any sort of legislation you were pushing that would have made someone do this? I'm not popular with the politicians. We, uh, guard, we, we should, we should get the captain here. Uh, this needs to be investigated immediately. Uh, as for you, uh, gentlemen, um, get out of my house, and, uh, we will speak tomorrow. Come to my office. How's that sound? That sounds Very fine. well. And I, you leave well, my house, you leave me alone, and I, uh, I will not have the guard, uh, arrest you. That Sorry sounds like intrusion. a fair... Okay. I'm, I, and I'm Good sorry night. for these circumstances that have fallen upon you. <laughs> Sweet dreams. <laughs> I do believe your wife's dead. I do, I do believe you have a good night, there, sir. <laughs> That's a dick. <laughs> All right, so you guys, you guys leave the house, and uh, uh, the con is seems absolutely distressed and just uh, utterly, utterly uh, mind fucked as he uh, as he sits down in the chair while you leave. And um, I want to thank all of you, um, every single last one of you, for breaking into his house, because um, these events were supposed to happen, but <laughs> they weren't supposed to happen while you were breaking into his house. <laughs> <laughs> I was not expecting that, okay? <laughs> <laughs> you, you mean before we broke into his house the first time? Remember, cause then he left and let us. In. <laughs> okay, guys, you can follow me. In. Why didn't you open the door? <laughs> Why the fuck would we want to go in the same way you did? <laughs> That's why we sent two of you? <laughs> the entire purpose of having us wait out here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> okay, Shut let's up. just get out of here. Yeah, <laughs> this, this, this house is creeping me out. Mm -hmm. I think I I need a I need a a bit of alcohol in me right now to make this. Officially, my Ow. campaign is now officially destroyed. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what are you talking about? I thought we did the events you wanted us to. Find. <laughs> I was expecting you to think he was a corpse fucker. <laughs> <laughs> well, we know that now. <laughs> oh god! I love how Eli goes up to there and does CSI Wormwick. Uh, can I actually? Have, there's one other thing I wanted to ask. Can I identify what weapon she was uh, decapitated with? Like, was who this cares? <laughs> something I'm sharp? Sorry, I'm sorry. I'm trying to figure out clues to who murdered a woman and left it in his bed. Jeez. I'm surprised you guys didn't pick up on the idea that there was a corpse in this man's master bedroom and the master bedroom was unlocked. <laughs> and the first thing we went to, wow, that guy's freaky. I just thought it was strange. I was like, oh, well, clearly he doesn't have locks in his master bedroom door. I mean, oh my sorry. god! <laughs> <laughs> that was a completely broken sequence on how to throw that together really fast. I'm sorry. No, it worked. I'm sorry. <laughs> it worked, dude, it worked. <laughs> No, this this is what I put in my notes for this this game. Let's <laughs> <laughs> see what this. Did. Oh, this one. That was why I texted away. Eighth major. It's leaving. Oh, 
was wrong. I realized I just fucking took his book. <laughs> <laughs> oh god, my secretary's dead. And my book is gone. <laughs> oh shit, did we find out if that was the secretary? <laughs> You don't know who it is. You don't know who it was. You don't. You can yeah, identify uh, it without the head. <laughs> you didn't get a good look at his secretary's body. She was sitting behind a desk. Mm -hmm. Oh, I well, got a good look. At well, body. well, if we go, if we go there tomorrow, the secretary's there without a head. They will know that it was her. That like, <laughs> or if it's a new body out without a head. <laughs> she, and she'll still talk in her weird voice. It'll be all funny. No, Chris is gonna be a new one, and then she's gonna wake up. And there's no shit in her cereal. She's gonna what? <laughs> oh, in jokes. Uh, <laughs> first thing you see when there's a corpse in someone's bed, you go, "He must want corpses." Well, <laughs> the story I, no, no, was no, 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 no. No, I did not assume that he slept with this corpse. It just they just kept it as a memento. Jesus. I assumed he slept with his, his wife's corpse in books on self-help. He sounded like a weirdo. Oh dear. All right. Um, you guys want to keep playing? Or? Yeah. Yes. I'm up for it. I really don't want to end on the note of you guys thought that I slept with my wife's corpse. What's wrong with you? <laughs> 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 Um, well, let's take a little break for now. I gotta hit the bathroom and uh, grab something yeah, yeah. to drink. Okay. Oh, got hey. something to eat real quick. But I'll be right back. Uh... As I said, I'm sorry for the, um, derp moment. Like, oh, I didn't open the door because uh, I am rusty. I haven't played in a few months. <clears throat> I, I still, I... Man, it's just like... Oh, uh, this is awful. <laughs> uh, change the topic. I'm looking through the uh, the the Guggenheim, and I have to say, I love the picture of Party at ArcLight. Have you seen that? Yeah. Uh, is, have you seen that one? Nice. Uh, is it the one that Darkfall drew? Uh, yeah, it was like, no, get out, no party, get out. <laughs> Oh, no, that one. That was almost... That's a Dark Vault one, yeah. Look at the, uh, the Kitra picture that Dark Vault drew. And you drew that like an hour ago. Cam He's really quick. Kitra, Cam yeah. Yeah. notes. British, British, British. She once managed to sneak all the way to the main house, only to realize she forgot to unlock the door to let her teammates in. <laughs> <laughs> party at Arc Light. I like how I just say Arc Light. It's party at Arc Light. I know. No, no party. Get out. What do you think? Like, I'm telling you, there's no party. I just, I just, you came all the way back out there to tell us to sneak in the same way you did. It was a moment for last reason. I, 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 me. Hey, hey, you know what? You know what? Hey, at least I was able to pick a lock with an arrow. <laughs> You couldn't do it with Thieves' Tools, though. No, both times my Thieves' Tools failed. How did I do it without their leadership? I'm pretty sure... No, I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty sure that Azab would have come to the same conclusion. As we did. Just saying. I don't know why people are giving us shit. Like, that like you all didn't come to the exact same fucking conclusion that he was sleeping with his dead wife. The 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 way that the clues were lined up. Yeah, he's... it's not like this is like, oh, how did you guys figure that out? You guys are sick fucks. Like, dude was in bed with his dead wife. That's what we yep, thought. That's, no, that's I know that after I asked questions, I was doing without his leadership. I'm saying ultimately we probably would have come to a similar conclusion. Hey Chris, you try to intimidate brainless creatures, and I didn't unlock a door. We're both jerks. Okay. We are. <laughs> I realized it when I made the stealth check. I was like, why? <laughs> You're like, why the fuck am I going over here? 
I, I, I still think you should have shot the arrow and shot him in the shoulder. Like, oh, well, look at here. It looked like I, I do believe I got a message. You I do to, believe like, the signal has been sent. On the way, ba- on the way back into the mansion, you had to make a stealth check so the people didn't hear you going. Fuck! <laughs> that was 15 minutes of our life. We'll never get back. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, now granted, I think from a staging standpoint, the re- the big reveal was still pretty funny. It's like, oh my god, what is that? Oh, I thought you. Oh, oh yeah, there's that. Um, that was already there when we arrived. I assure you. <laughs> to be to be fair, <laughs> Drew's Drew's not very good at being diplomatic. He is. Slayfield, be... I'm not a thief. I'm not a thief though. I'm a hunter. <laughs> I, I, I am uh, more. And, and, I could. And, I could intimidate like you know. I can intimidate more so like somebody's business, but I'm mainly. Isn't just... failing at being black. He's just using that voice because Spoon is not here to sell him off. I do yeah. believe. I do believe. I want. To, I want to make a character that does voice. And I was like, fuck it. I'll just do it with Eli. <laughs> look, look, boy, boy, boy. I say, boy, boy. You can't stop me from talking like this, boy. Well, look at here. If need be, I will shove a boot up all of your candy asses. The only thing that I don't understand is why you think it sounds like Foghorn Leghorn. Because I do believe it does sound a little bit like Foghorn Leghorn. Except That's not that Foghorn Leghorn does not say I do believe every five words. <clears throat> That's not who I am supposed to be. It is supposed to be a Southern gentleman. Is what it is supposed I mean, to be. Basically, but... I, mean, co- I mean, you guys can complain about how many times we effed up, but honestly... Hey, we got the job I... done. That's all that matters. Honestly, and to be fair, making a deal with Owain Wayne that we're going to kill someone is an equally problematic F up in my book. Yeah, so. I don't really know why the fuck we did that. <laughs> I think it was because there was a death knight there, and it's kind of like having Satan stare down at you, and he's like, go fucking do it. Like, okay, sir! <laughs> yeah, I don't okay, believe I'll totally do, do that. that! Totally gonna do that! Don't kill us! Yes, well... <laughs> I think what's going to happen once we go back into town is that one, my leg's going to heal. Oh, wait, no, wrong campaign. I'm thinking about my ace as an ace character, Doc Brown. It's like, I'm going to go back to town, heal up my leg, determine that nearby whiskey is not that good, and make my own distillery. We may need to go. I don't know who we talked to at this point because that kind of threw a wrench in a lot of things. I think we need to stay in one or two rooms instead of five so we can protect each other. I'll from... sleep with Arclight. But what about our characters? <laughs> <laughs> Actually, it does make the most sense if we had to. Well, I guess we can have... Well, no, we probably don't want any one person sleeping alone, so... It actually probably does make the most sense to have the holy man be the one who has to share the room with the opposite gender. <laughs> And then I can I shoot. Guess. I can shoot arrows into you, saying, "Hey, are you awake?" <laughs> yeah. If there's an arrow emergency, you can help. <laughs> you wake up and there's an arrow in your shoulder. Like, did I? Yo, no, did I put that in before I went to bed again? Uh, that's a, that's a, that's a for- Fosk is rolling up a new character for Aces and Eights because one got shot. The 15 year old Mexican child got shot in the knee and will never walk again. So he's rolling up a new character. With a looky here. And then I, whenever I try to go to it, we'll look oh, here, young girl. Oh, oh, that is awful, Fosk. You're making a snake oil salesman. That will be fun. Because you're going to have a snake oil salesman and a doctor in the same party. I'm going to be like, seriously, like, you know, the stuff you're selling doesn't do anything. You're, you, you're, you, like, you're going to have the problem, Fosk, of having a doctor and a chemist in your party who can just, like, take whatever you're making and, like, say, this is water with sugar in it. I thought this was D&D and not Aces and Eights. Yeah, but yeah. we're not really doing anything <laughs> right now. We're just kind of waiting around for I mean, right now, I don't know what we're going to do. I mean, we're going to go back to our rooms, sleep for the rest of the night, probably get shot by another arrow or two, we go to this guy tomorrow, and then get shot by more arrows. <laughs> I say I do believe. Well, I do believe you. 
LK is busy trying to salvage his campaign. Wait, <laughs> we did good things. He's on no, the he didn't. We fucked off. up the order of events completely. 